48 now, uh, <laughs> starting Thursday, roughly 200 ballroom dancers will gather right here for the, not, not the studio, but <laughs> in the city, uh, for the eighth annual Cincinnati Ballroom Classic. It is the city's only dance competition that draws crowds for its special theme nights with American and international dance flavor. Participants will dance nearly 4,000 entries during a three-day competition. Oh. I want you to meet Josh and Stacy Tilford, who are going to be taking part in the conference. Good to see you both. See Husband you. and wife team. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're an instructor, you're not. That's right. right. Well, tell us a little bit about how you guys got into ballroom dancing. Um, I started about 12 years ago, um, went to a local studio, was taking some lessons, and just fell in love with it. So yeah. then did you have to convince Stacy to go with you, or? No, we actually met dancing at a friend's wedding. Oh, oh neat. Yeah. There you go. Yes. Yes. There you yes. go. So right. yeah. Uh, now, now this, uh, th this event that's happening here, uh, it's a competition. Uh, tell us a little bit how this is going to work. So Thursday evening kicks off the nightclub, which we're going to show you a little bit of that uh, later. Okay. And then uh, Friday and Saturday, there's dancing from 8 in the morning until about 10 p.m. midnight. It runs all day and it, it gets escalates from like beginning levels all the way to pros. Excellent. Yeah. Now you have uh, you have people from all over the country, all over the world who are coming in for this. Is that right? Yes. Um, where where do they come from and, and you know, why is this getting to be such a big sport? Um, there's over a hundred competitions nationwide throughout the year, mm -hmm. and I think with the the dance shows like Dancing with the Stars yeah. and yeah. So You Think mm -hmm. You Can Dance, um, it, ballroom dancing has really gained a lot of traction recently, and um, there's just tons of competitors now. Mm -hmm. All right, I, and, and ballroom dance, from what we can see, is a, it, it encompasses a bit more than what somebody uh, who hasn't been watching those kind of shows would, would expect. And you're going to give us a sample of something right now, right? T yeah. Tell us what yeah. you're gonna, the style. We're going to dance a little hustle, a little throwback to the oh. 70s. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Josh yeah. and Stacy, have yeah. <laughs> Thank you. And they're all different levels of ballroom dancing, yes. right? Yeah, this yeah. was just a little um, basic nightclub, something that you could, you know, lead and follow. Something mm -hmm. easy. Yeah. Yeah. Something easy. Not easy. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but that's just it. You just don't show up and do this. Right. I, I mean, you have, to, you have to kind of rehearse and choreograph what you're going to do. Mm -hmm. Yes. We've trained yeah. for a while, but yeah. We yes. threw this one together this morning. So if people yeah. want to <laughs> learn this, they can come to your studio, right, Josh? Yes. Tell us where you are. And uh, I'm in North Avondale. Okay, what's the name of the studio? Dance Manor. You can go to dancemanor.com. Dance Manor. Dance Manor. And definitely mm -hmm. check out the... Uh, competition website, cincybc.com. You can get all the dates right. and info. But there. even if you don't dance, you can go down and watch. Yeah, yeah. I think Absolutely. we have some information we can show you right yeah. here. It's Thursday through Saturday at the Hyatt Regency. Uh, and just go to local12.com and click on the Get It link, and we got all the details. You can go down and be as envious as you would like. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much Thank for you. getting up early with us. Your little girl was yeah. really good, too. <laughs>